The National Road Safety Authority has described as woefully inadequate the 6.5 million cities granted for road safety sensitization as part of an action plan to curb road crashes. Public Relations Officer of the Authority, Kwame Kodia, said the mandate of the authority requires a lot more resources to execute. An action plan to tackle road carnage in the country was approved in March 2018 by President Akufuado. The plan provided, among other things, an additional 6.5 million cities for public sensitization and education. Though the money was released to the authority and used for its purpose, Public Relations Officer of the Authority, Kwame Kodia, says the authority requires more funds. I mean, it was supposed to be in 2018. Yes. Yes, yeah, so in 2018, throughout last year, we received the amount in full. Okay. Yeah, so there are no outstanding uh, payments due on that, as far as I'm concerned. In as much as the gesture is appreciated, if we intend to do um, three advertisements for three TV stations, not less than, not even up to ten radio stations, that amount of money won't even take us for a quarter. As part of the sensitization campaign, he said the authority is also training some 13,000 selected high-risk drivers across the country. The money has been received and it's been expended for the purpose for which it was given. Part of it is the over 13,000 um, drivers that we have identified across the country um, on, on routes that we consider to be very challenging. And try to refresh them through some trading together with the police and DVLA. Kwame Kodia said the authority has had to collaborate with institutions like the Ghana Journalists Association and the Ghana Independent Broadcasters Association, GIBA, to pull off its sensitization drive because it does not have the staff strength. He called on the general public to take road safety a collective responsibility.